We'll talk about row and column vectors now. Let's make some column vectors. X equals, open brackets, 5. I'm going to hit enter. And now I'm going to hit 4 and enter. 3, enter, 2, and close brackets. And I've now got myself a finished product. We just made a column vector. And there she is. Wow. Is that the only way to make a column vector? Ah. Mais non, mes enfants. Here we go. Y equals open brackets 5. This time, comma. 4, comma, 3, comma. Whoops. 4, comma, enter. 3, comma, enter. 2, comma. Well, no, we'll end it there. Two and close square brackets. And, oh my goodness, we get the same thing. Y equals 5, 4, 3, 2. And once again, what have we done? We just made a column vector. Wow. Well, we can do column vectors. Let's do a row vector. Let's do it the clever way. I want to make a row vector. I'm going to call it X. I want it to go from 3 all the way to 7. But notice what I did not do here. I did not specify an increment operator. I didn't say increment each value from 3 to 7 by 1 half or by 1 fourth. I didn't do that at all. So what will be the default increment as it traverses 3 to 7? It's going to be 1, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. What do you know? Huh. What do you know? Well, how about... How about... Um, let's do it the opposite way. If the default increment is 1, what happens if I say x equals brackets... 7 all the way to 3. Now what's going to happen? If the increment operator is by default 1, how's it going to do this? Answer, it will not do this. It cannot do this. 7 plus 1 is 8. 8 plus 1 is 9. You're not getting closer to 3. You're getting further away from it. Oh no, we're going to have to set we're going to have to specify the increment opera operator, or in this case, the decrement operator. X equals open brackets 7 colon, and here comes my decrement operator, negative 1, and then 3. Now, I'm going to lay odds that I get myself the value of 7, 6, 5, 4, 3. And there we go. 7, 6, 5, 4, 3. That is just truly amazing. Huh. When we tried to do it this way, without specifying the increment operator, MATLAB turned angry birds on us. Oh, no, I can't do that. I can't add 1 to 7 and come closer to 3. Empty matrix. Wow. Well, that's all I've got to say for now. This is George Bull saying bye-bye.